Hey guys, so I made the back roller. I totally forgot. Um, <laughs> I totally forgot that it's gonna print in air and I didn't print supports. But what I wanna do, so I don't need supports because I don't, I mean, the finish looks nice without the supports. So I'm gonna smooth this out like a curve. That way I don't need supports. I just need to make it um, at an angle a little bit. But it's still printed, amazing. This one's off the Prusa. Uh, perimeter two layers and 5% uh, infill and I actually tried it out it works but it makes this creaking noise if you pray it, it still works but um, it does make some creaking noise which means it's not solid solid enough uh, next I did this is also the five perimeters the same thing but um if for some reason my ender stopped printing um, I'm gonna have to find out why so this is 5% infill uh, this is five. This is five layers. All right. And now I have this one that I printed out. This is only two percent gyroid. All right. This one makes a lot of a lot more creaking sound. This had bigger per perimeters, so I need to really beef up. I think you don't need like seven perimeters, maybe five, but you definitely need much more infill. Um, so I'm going to try ten percent now. This is five percent. Uh. 5% infill so hopefully 10% will solve the issues I mean this is still usable but obviously I don't think it's gonna last I mean for rolling your back I think it's gonna be fine but it just makes that sound and I just don't feel safe in it to use it for long but it's still very very hard I mean you could almost stand on it um, but yeah so progress failed a design fail um, but you know, that's part of what makes 3D printing fun. Anyway, we'll have updates on my back roller. <laughs> oh yeah. And the, my printer made a mess because it lost. We'll see. I came back this morning. I was like, what is this? I saw like this thing laying way over here. <laughs> so yeah, I didn't have supports and it's still printed. This is amazing because it printed like this. Um, it was printing in air, eventually it caught up and it even printed the top, but when it got to the top surface, I think the alignment was wrong and then it probably just threw the whole thing out, and then it just started printing hairball. <laughs> anyway, um, I'm going to go ahead and try my second version and see if it comes out a good back roller. <laughs> 